Okay, right, so task 7.2. I'm assuming you have already either installed our studio and are on your laptop or personal PC, or you might be on a university computer. Uh, in which case you should be able to find the RStudio icon on the desktop if it's already been installed. If it hasn't been installed, then if you go to the worksheet, there's a little guide here, and uh, that will show you how to uh, install it. You get to hear my lovely voice again. Um, but if, I'm assuming you've done that. Uh, the next thing we're going to do is we're actually going to open our studio. So click on that icon. I've already got it running. Um, so I'm going to create a new um, R Studio project for this particular worksheet. Okay, um, so I'm just going to go file and uh, new project. Um, do, do, do. I'm going to click new directory. I'm going to click empty project, and I'm going to go to my D -D -D documents. I'm going to open up that and I'm going to create a new directory called intro underscore to underscore r. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, create that project. Okay, so all it's doing now is essentially just creating an empty folder in my uh, my documents. Create an empty folder and then it's put in this intro to r project file. Okay, now what that project file um, is a single file is is. It's a, it's a single file that um, essentially links all script files and data files all together. So in future, you only have to go file, um, open project, open that, and it'll pull everything you need together out of that directory uh, and keep it all nice and tight together and you won't lose anything, right? So I definitely advocate you use our project files in future. Um, and that was it. That was all I wanted you to do to 7.2 is to create um, this. And you should see exactly the same um, thing on your desktop as I am seeing right now. Okay. Um, if not, something might have gone wrong. That's not a problem. Um, just uh, figure it out by... You can either talk to me on Teams uh, or you can come along to one of the workshops and, uh, and we'll figure it out. Okay. Right. Let's move on, shall we?